Welcome back to the Ben Breakfast Show. If you're just tuning in, you've missed a lot. You've missed the news, you've missed the paper review, you've missed the inspirational section. But anyway, we still have more for you on the Ben Breakfast Show. Right now, I have another wonderful guest in the studio today. It's coming to talk about something really interesting, and I'm sure you will like it. So I have Mr. Stephen Akintayo. He's, he's the CEO of GTEx Group, and he's also a serial entrepreneur. Welcome, sir, to the Ben Breakfast Show. Thank you very much. It's Thank nice you for joining us. I like your... African outfit. Yeah, I'm African. <laughs> we are African. We are African. <laughs> and you know what they say about this hat now? Yeah. I think that um, Hausa hat is really trending now. Yeah, it is. Yeah, you uh, know. Uh, God, those days you look at it, I'm like, no, but now it, everybody wears yeah, it on Agbada. And it's good. It's very good. You, know, you, look, you look like the prince like from, a king. of king from Zamora. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you for joining us on the Thank Ben Breakfast Show. So now, tell us about your journey being an entrepreneur before we even go into all the things you've been doing it's 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 been interesting and very very challenging in fact i i, I just got an invitation to to speak to student at access university mm -hmm. i was telling um, my host that i'm going to talk to them about uh, how to start um, your entrepreneurial journey as a student mm -hmm. Um, but my own personal story. So I, while I was saying, I was just laughing that it was a tough, tough experience. I had sold popcorn wow. uh, at big uh, events, uh, redeem camp, you know. Oh, you go to redeem camp. Um, yeah, wow. as, for business. For business, not, no. <laughs> <laughs> not for prayers. <laughs> for, the, for business. Yeah. I mean, I, I've done almost 50 business in my life. Wow. So it's, it's, it's funny how... Wow. Uh, but today, I'm, I'm grateful because those foundational experiences, yes. you fail, you try, you fail, you try. I've built you up to what yeah, you are today. Exactly. So, so you said, I'm just obviously inquisitive. Yeah. You've done popcorn business. What yeah. other, tell me two I've more you've done. I've sold books. Books? I've done, what kind of books? Um, uh, motivational business okay. books. Did you uh, write them? No. No, no, no. For okay. other people. For other people. Okay. Um, I've sold CDs, DVDs. I've sold. <laughs> <laughs> I've done roadside trade fairs. Oh, you know, they have your where stalls. I host it. Oh, so people come, have their really? various stores and stalls. pay me a token. Nice. Uh, you, I mean, oh man. <laughs> You've done everything. Yeah. Nice. So now yeah. let's talk about what you do right now. Um, well, I'm a serial entrepreneur. I, I, I own about 18 businesses. Wow. Yes. And, um, uh, but the part I'm getting more interested in, um, interested in and excited about is the training part, uh, consulting part, where I, I'm trying to replicate myself in other people. I have a vision of um, one million entrepreneur by the year 2025. 20, uh, wow. Um, train one million entrepreneur. So, I do a lot of global tours where I just have meetings with people mm. who want to become entrepreneurs and uh, are having that challenge because I think strongly that Africans need to begin to consider the subject of entrepreneurship. Yes, they should. We, we, but we, we, I think, yeah. sorry, would you agree with me that right now in, I can only speak for Nigeria, I'm Nigerian, <laughs> so I don't know about other African countries, but yeah. I think that the percentage in you know, on young entrepreneurs have increased because you don't, people don't have jobs again. Exactly. So, and people are using Instagram exactly. to be mostly fashion designers, yeah. makeup artists. Everyone I know in Lagos or Nigeria are yeah. doing something. I'm excited about it um, because you, a lot of young people now understand that you leave school, don't forget about trying to get a job. Forget it's it. not there. Yeah. Um, so the momentum is building, mm. uh, but we also have this issue where we all just want to go where everybody is going. Yeah, they do that a lot. You know, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> like, I'm doing one business, all you need to do is start. And the next thing they're copying. So everybody yeah. want to do like a uh, social thing. person that's yeah. made it. And before you know it, you water the business, everybody's into it. I mean, it's nothing again. Um, so for me, I have this uh, model where I teach 20 profitable businesses you can do on the internet. Please, can you share that? <laughs> Because, yeah, yeah, because the internet like you have is taking over the world. Yeah. So you need to let people know that even staying at home, mm -hmm. they can make millions, right? Lots of money. So what, give us five out of the 20 businesses <sighs> that you can do at home. We will not live here. Okay, give us one, one. So, 
I'll, I'll try my five. So one is this. This is a, a smart watch. Yes. Um, you can receive call, check your blood pressure, and all, all of that. Yes. I have a student in New York who got this for 66 cents. Wow. And sold it for $60 a piece. Wow. That's nice. Yeah, we call it lightweight importation, mm -hmm. mini importation. Um, there are a lot of stuff, not just this. Oh, definitely. Where was, um, it? Where was it manufactured? Of course. Of course. Where else? China. Where? <laughs> Of course. <laughs> Where else? <laughs> of course. Yeah. The branded version of this, mm. you brand it Apple, um, Samsung, is going for $200. Okay. Uh, however, the, we still manufacture in China. In China. So, I mean, I think people need to learn to understand that most of the products used globally now are manufactured in China, in China. not necessarily by Chinese companies. Yeah. So, you know, oh, they may be American yes. companies but they are manufacturing in China. China. So like this now is not necessarily like a Chinese product, but, yeah. um, you know, uh, but it's manufactured there. So when they make this, obviously, yeah. smart watch, like you call it, yeah. you know, there's a new one too, like Fitbit. Yes. That you, you know, you, you jog and it measures your calorie yeah. burning, yeah. The, um, your sleep pattern and all yeah. that. Do you now like brand it on your own brand and sell it online? Yes, you can tell the manufacturer to brand it in your name, mm. so instead of Apple or anything, and it would be the same quality. Oh. In fact, Rolex wristwatches yeah. can be gotten in, in these places. Wow. Yes. If I had a friend who got two mm. and then was coming to the U.S. and they, they seized it, uh, the custom seized it, wow. and took it to Rolex, and, and Rolex had to have a meeting with him that it's the exact Rolex which was oh except with their own markings oh. that you used to know that it took it out. So oh, it's the yeah. same manufacturing plant where it's yeah. done yeah. that this was also okay. done. So, so it's the same thing with fashion wear. Yeah, so I was about to go. We, this is the first one you can do. What's yeah. the second one? Um, so also you can do what we call uh, uh, affiliate marketing. Oh, yes. Yes. Um, be it, but software is now a major one. You can do affiliate marketing in software. Uh, where you help people promote yeah, their brand. software products online with, on Facebook and Twitter and social media, and you make a lot of money. I've trained students who make $10,000 every month. Wow. Uh, yes, uh, you know, doing this. I uh, should register to that. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Yeah, so what's we, the third one? We also have um, what we call, and this is, this is really, really interesting, we call it information marketing. And this is really one of the easiest for anybody to do. So it's a business model where you look for information, a niche where people are looking for information, like in sex, in um, niches like how to make money online, mm. niches like health, uh, niches like beauty. Mm -hmm. mm, you're bigger. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Thank so, you. Um, and then you become a brand in that. You mm. need to talk about the aspect of this things mm. that people need to know more. So you can author books, you can have vi audio materials, oh. you can have video materials, yeah. you sell them on Amazon and several other leading stores globally. Yeah. And you make a lot of, of money. money from that. What else? The fourth one. <laughs> the fourth one, um, we call it, um, I'm, I'm looking at which one to pick. You're trying uh, to, you don't want to 20. tell us, you don't want to tell us the big ones so the people can they're, come they're from the, all, all big, right? They're, they're all big because it, it doesn't matter where I mention them or, or not, not. Yeah. you still need a lot of information okay, as to how to go from home. about it. The mini importation is 100% home. Now, but there are three types of that. Mm. We have the mini importation where you sell on leading stores like Shopify, Amazon, yeah, Konga, yeah. Jumia. Then we have one called drop shipping. I was about to talk about that. Yeah, so for drop shipping, you don't even touch the product. Yeah, like it's third party. Yes, you're, you're the middle person. Mm. So you have your own website. Mm. People make an order. Once they make an order, you, the, the drop shipping person. company gets a mail. Mm. So they supply the, match, the, the customer in your brand. Mm. You know, so it's branded you. Yeah. But you don't even see the product oh, okay. at all. So we we'll call it drop shipping. Um, it's also a very fantastic business because you can do it from home. You don't touch the product. You don't need to have a warehouse. Mm. You don't do any of these things. That one is good. You know, yes, and, and, and it's amazing, uh, and it's a very, very good, good business yeah. to, to, to do. It's so interesting uh, how, 
like what you said, there's yeah. so many business people can yeah. do, 20. and people don't even have an idea of what they can actually do. Yeah. Like, you might not even leave your house and you'll be making millions, but everything we all need is inf information, like you said. I, I tell people that there's no mountain anywhere in the world. Every man's mountain is his ignorance. True. Yeah. It's True. his ignorance. So now, let's talk about this event yeah. coming up. Yeah. Switch London. Yes. Can we, can we hear more about it? Um, so we have three um, um, cities mm -hmm. uh, for Switch. We have Leicester City this Saturday. Yeah. Uh, we have um, um, Scotland yeah. next Saturday. Then we have Eric. Um, okay, that's 18th. London. That's I was London. about to say, you're actually <laughs> London. Like, seriously, you're going to Leicester, you don't want to come to London? Uh, yeah, so... so have, London is uh, the last one, Yes, right? London is the last one. It's the big one because okay. the venue uh, can take as much as 500 people. Okay. Uh, so, um, you, it's an event that really people need to attend. Um, in fact, the, the beauty was that it was demanded for. So the Eric one is a, is a whole church, yeah. and they are even footing the bill, so it's free. Okay. They just said, you know what, we need to. Oh. Uh, the Scotland one also um, is, I think, uh, the regional church redeemed. Uh, okay. You know, they just said, you know what, the the oil business in Scotland mm -hmm. is having challenge. A lot of people have lost their job, and they just need to know to alternative yeah. things to do. Mm -hmm. So uh, and then we have the London one, who, which we are hosting. Yeah. And, and in it's, it's, yes. So can you tell us the dates of this event? Um, so for the London one is 18th, at yeah. 10 a.m., um, yeah. 18th of, of um, November. Where? Um, yes, Eric P2 yeah. um, Event Center yeah. um, is the venue. Um, mm -hmm. So you can just visit www.stevenakintyre.com forward slash switch. Okay, uh, so go if to you want bright. all the information, you go to www.stevenakintyre.com forward slash switch forward slash switch yes or just and go, the, to and go to Bright. and also to the flyer is on switch. the screen yes for you to get more information yes sako will also be there okay. some of you know sako yeah we do the comedian okay so you'll be there that in the london one right yes in the okay, london in the london one it's going to be anchoring the whole event okay so is it going to be a paid event for the london one is a paid event okay. um as we we don't have a, a big host oh, doing that yeah. So, yeah but for the leicester city is free mm. um the scotland event is also i think it's just it's 50 pounds but they're doing 50 percent discount okay. for that okay yeah so and you said that obviously you're going to be discussing a lot of things career advancement yeah so so financial management. yeah so we're going to, well, there are three aspects of the training there's the aspect of showing you 20 profitable businesses can you can do uh, one of them is even um, investing in cryptocurrency. See, Bitcoin. Bit we have somebody has been talking about Bitcoin, that. Yeah. you know, just moved. I mean, early this year it was just 2,000. No, it's like 3,000. It's, it's 6,000. Oh, my God. Yeah, it's 6,000. Oh, my goodness. Yeah. Wow. <laughs> you know. And so 20 profitable business. Then the second part is um, and uh, under the 20 business, we also look at real estate, mm. uh, real estate opportunity. Uh, in Africa, in Nigeria, as well as here in the UK. Yeah. So how, even if you're not buying, you can be a real estate referral oh, agent wow. and earn 20% commission. Nice. And, and we're so there'll be a lot of this. information going yeah, on on yes. the three events at Scotland, yes. London, and Leicester. And yes, well, City. the third part is now the investment part, where we now talk about prudence, structure, uh, how to, because y you don't become rich by any more you become rich by managing more, yeah. you know, and so we're also going to be looking at that aspect too. It so. will be nice um, <laughs> for people to attend. I'm yeah. going to be there because I yeah. really want to yeah. make extra income too. <laughs> Thank you so much, Mr. You're, you're Stephen, welcome. for joining us on the bed. One that will suit you is called uh, freelancing. Okay. Um, how you can be a freelance um, person. For you as a journalist, mm -hmm. you can do short recordings yeah. and videos for people yeah. and they pay you a hundred pounds per hour. That would be nice too. I would like the watch. So I, want the, I want the smart, I want the smart <laughs> watch too. Okay. I want that too. Thank you so much you're for joining well, us on the welcome. Band Breakfast you're Show. Welcome. Still on the Band Breakfast Show, we will go on a quick break now and when we return the Band Breakfast Show continues, don't go anywhere like I always say. We will be right back. <laughs> 